Our hashtag Safari Live is how you can talk to us. And it is apparently 61 degrees Fahrenheit out here today. And that is the gorgeous Tingana. Oh, marvelous. Isn't he wonderful? He's still so big and fat, just like the last time we saw him, Seb. Yes. Seb is on camera today. And he is just depositing a popcorn flavored scent. And I will just warn you that there are quite a few people hoping to see him today, so we probably won't be able to spend all day with him, but we'll spend as long as we can. He's also going to cross into some pretty thick bush. What a joy it's beginning to our safari. Ooh. Hold on everyone, there's gonna be some nasty off-roading here. Oh dear. Um, he's gonna go into this thick bush. I'm just gonna head across here. Get around this thicket. Hold on tight, everyone. I'm sorry about the racing about, but this is what happens if you want to spend time with big male leopards on the prowl. This is the kind of bush they like, thick stuff. If you are a new viewer, Tingana is about, oh, I've almost forgotten his age. He must be nearly 10 by now. He was nine last year, which means he must be ten this year at some stage. He's coming down this path, I hope. You see him there? Just turn off and listen. There's Texan. Let me just quickly ask him if you still got him. Tex, have you still got him there? Have you still got him there? I think he's further this way, Seb. Along this path. He's going to pop out somewhere here. And I think he will cross the drainage line. Is, whoops, that is the river of the Great Mulwati, somewhere around here. Oh, please let us not have that as the only view of him today. You can't see him, can you? Holly, I'm afraid I completely missed your question there. The game drive radio is going ballistic in my ear right now. Just, I still can't hear anything cursed, sorry. Oh, We've just got it. There he is. Oh dear, this car will not go into reverse. That's a disaster. I've got him there. Holly, I will get back to you, sorry. The game drive radio is just going crazy because everyone wants to come and see him. Okay, try now, Kirst. He was here. There he is. I'm afraid I missed that too. Is he looking for a what spot? A sleeping spot. Yes, I, I, he will eventually sleep as soon as it starts to get warm. But there he is. All right, we've relocated him, everybody. He's now mobile, still north, but it looks like he's gonna go into the drainage. Yeah, I think stand by in the drainage there. Ah, wonderful stuff. Don't go in there, Tingana. He's on the game path now, uh, parallel with the Morati. Sorry, everybody, I know that this is deeply irritating, but the game 
drive radio, there's four or five people trying to get into the sighting. Um, and so everyone's talking at once. I'll just turn it down a bit. Now I can hear your questions properly. You can hear the birds alarm calling. I think he's going down now. Yeah. No stations, he's now heading into the Morati. It's amazing how quickly they can disappear. He walked into that thicket and he, whew, he was gone. I just happened to look behind me at the right time and there he was. Leopard tracking is hugely based on luck. Yeah, now he's going to disappear into the drainage here and we're not going to be able to see him unless we go around to the other side. I seriously doubt, there he is. I seriously doubt we're going to be able to, well, maybe we'll be able to follow him through here. You got in there, Sip? No, there he is. Okay. All right, I've now stalled the vehicle. You know what, I can't do this with gloves on. <laughs> All righty, here we go. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Right, there he is, I can see him. All right, everybody, let us let me try and get through this mess. Let's get across to Tristan. He's got a lovely, much more calming view of the sunrise.